nice to see you again. Hello, Kathleen. How you doing, sweetheart? George is here. You're opening act, George. Right. Yes, absolutely. Co-headliner. Co no, yeah. no, no. Opening act and was proud to be it. Believe Carlin and Gifford. Boy, what a team. Huh? <laughs> you get nostalgic when you come back to New York? Yeah, I uh, I carry a lot of New York inside me, you know, in my sure. head and in my heart. Not to be no, no, they the things I needed. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they, didn't, they, didn't, they didn't have revolution. <laughs> yeah. Acting goofy. Oh, great. <laughs> Uh, the show's doing well, huh? Thank you, yes, it is. I love the is. character, George. Yeah, it's it's very close to me, you know. That's what you wanted to do. Yes. Yeah, I had a, a fifth grade autobiography. Sure. <laughs> My first one. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and, and the last page or chapter or whatever it is uh, was supposed to be... Yeah, Sunday nights at uh, 9.30 p.m. on uh, Fox. Mm -hmm. Now, this particular clip, you're sending your friend Beck off on a hunting trip? Yeah, Beck is the, the one person out of place. He's shown up this time in, in his hunting gear. Oh. And um, O'Grady has a question. All right, let's take that. a look at this, the George Carlin show. Well, she happens to be one of my favorite years. ladies. Well, she's, she's a terrific woman. She might be watching this morning. Hi, oh. honey, be home soon. And uh, she's doing great. Yeah. We're all feeling good. She's a patient woman to be putting up with. The 33 years. 33 That's patient. years with yes. George Carlin? Yes. Come on. Yes. To heaven. There are no stop for that. No stop George, it's great to see Thank you. you. Good luck Thanks on the so show, much. okay? Thanks Sunday much. nights on Fox at 9.30. We'll be right back with Amy Brennan. Okay, our next guest is a talented actress who began performing at the tender age of 11. She could be seen every Tuesday night playing Officer Janice. Thank you, right? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, my last Yes, look what happened to you, Amy, huh? I'm the number one show everybody's talking about. No. Yes, indeed. <laughs> well, you trained for it. You worked hard for it. I did. Mm -hmm. I did. Went to Harvard, right? Yeah, yeah. I didn't actually study acting. Andy. I was, um, I was very... For lightning struck with this series. Uh, no, I was cast here. Oh, I yeah, did. I had to move out, relocate. Oh. Relocate, they call it. Right. That's a Sometimes word. they come here to find uh, that new face that Especially they want. Especially for a know? New York series exactly. about that, that life. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. four, four of the six regular ones. <laughs> but what, when they told boyfriend. you that you were going to be nude, you know, for the first time on, on uh, and the very first scene? episode. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. yeah. What were your thoughts? Um, we're over 18. <laughs> Um, well, to be perfectly honest, I, I was doing another project when I was cast, and so I didn't... It was about 40 people, which... Always seems like. to be more guys <laughs> than... That, <laughs> it cracks me up, pardon the pun, crack, but... <laughs> they, that, that in, a, in, in a new scene like that, they clear the set yes. is for your privacy, and then millions of people see it afterwards. I know. <laughs> you know? I know. It is odd. I'm sure it makes it easier at the time, but then it everybody's going to get a chance to I see know. it if they want to anyway, right? I know. So Did you watch it at home with your mom and yeah. dad? I didn't watch it with my mom and dad. I watched it. Gee, we've only got a couple minutes left. You know, this was Academy Award Day around here. There was so much to talk about. We I hadn't know. seen each other. I was bumped. No, <laughs> no, Love Chef was bumped. Well, you're, you're, you're a terrific guest, and we'd love to have you back oh, I'd anytime. Love to be back. I know you're in New York this week shooting exteriors right. for the show. What right. is that like? What does that mean for, for the folks out there? Uh, well, they really feel <laughs> it. <laughs> but that's what gives shy. the show its energy that's and right. its appeal, I think. Yeah. Sure, come yeah. back as much as you can. Now, you had a very interesting question before we went to commercial. Oh, while we were in commercial. Listen, listen, now listen, this is two, two ladies talking. <laughs> Penetrating tell stuff. Her, tell her what I mean, How red is David Caruso's hair? <laughs> really? I mean, is it like carroty red? Yeah. Or is it really? It's really? Yes, you know, you never know what he's getting involved in next, yeah. but you it's know, always it'll be something. Wonderful. Yeah, absolutely. He's such a curious person. It's and really he's still a, a child inside. Uh, which did you is see so the sweet. Academy Awards last I night? I did, yeah. yeah. I said, oh, my boss won. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wasn't that nice that he won? <laughs> it's lovely. Absolutely. Yeah. Andy, I want you to come back. Yeah, I'm Hey, NYPD tonight on ABC at 10 o'clock. We'll be right back. John and I were uh, appeared on Mike Francesa's show a couple of months ago over at the Garden. Oh, really? Oh, it's tell a little honor. Oh, listen, uh, tell me about the comedy clubs these days. Are they still in? Are they out? What? I think going? it's out, Regis. I think uh, because people can see it on TV. Uh, just, uh, just decorative? Yeah, though, though this sucks in the air to feed the Let's pull this one off. What this, kind of car is this? This car is something that you will be able to next buy. Next year? Next year, 1995, the Lincoln. Lincoln. Oh, well. It's like Jaws. You American know? cars are getting wonderful, aren't they? What yeah. is this called? Sand this color? Friends. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Thank you. Thank you. Hi. 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 Hi.
Emilio, this this movie is a tremendous hit. Uh, the yeah. Mighty Ducks. I mean, yeah. it spawned a hockey Pirate, club. Yeah. 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 But what, what, why do you think it caught everybody's fancy so? Well, I think the it looked yeah. like you'd been on the ice all your life. Yeah, of course yeah. I did. Uh, <laughs> and then I ran from the meeting. <laughs> the to, old story. Uh, can I skate? You kidding? Sure, I all my life. Can you skate? Can I skate? To this day, whenever I put those skates on, my ankles begin to burn. Yeah, the best part about skating is taking. Did he really? Yeah. Rollerblading can be can be dangerous. You better yeah. put him in all his uh, yeah, paraphernalia. The, the the so cast for this is a great name, but I just didn't think it was going to fit in with the Toronto Maple Leafs, you know, <laughs> yeah. and the Detroit well, got, Red Wings. Yeah, the mighty then you ducks. got the Penguins. Yeah, yeah that's yeah, right. So that's uh, I'd rather the, be a duck than a penguin. At least you can fly. <laughs> Home. So what else is going on in your life? How's Paula? She's great. She's uh, back in the recording. That is a <laughs> surprise a, for all of us. You know. <laughs> kind of a milestone in this in this business. Yeah, you yeah. Know, when when uh, people take relationships, I think for granted. Back, we'll take a look at a scene from the Mighty Ducks. Because he's having fun with Mighty Ducks. Because he loves it. Yeah. Interesting. I was just driving by your old high school the other day out there in California. Sure, Santa Monica. Santa, well, remember the days when uh, you, your brother, and your dad used to join me at Rio Blair's place, remember, in Hollywood? Oh, we all, right. We were on vitamin therapy at the time. That's it was right. an experiment. <laughs> you <laughs> took about 300 a day, didn't about, you? About, uh, how many did we take? It was you know, about, about 300 vitamins a day. 250, yeah. as yeah. many as That would take all day. Well, I wanted to see what it would do. It felt better in my life. I was nauseous all the time. Yeah. <laughs> I would think so. It, 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 it was, was an awful lot of vitamins. You're absolutely yeah. right. And then we would go into those hot and cold baths, remember? Right, right. How, how, do you remember the temperatures you could take? It's I really don't. a challenge. To, to uh, excite the circulatory system, we would take hot and cold baths after taking these vitamins. And Gee, I, I can suggest something much better than that. <laughs> you know, well, you know, we just... <laughs> when I do this, it means I'm seeing the seven-year itch. <laughs> uh, it was a lot of fun in those days, yeah. Yeah, but you know, Rio Blair uh, died. Oh, right, right. No, I was just going to say, I didn't know that. I said, that's got to be so hard on your kidneys to take that many vitamins. I, I, but sorry. The, sorry, Rio, this <laughs> came up here. He was a wonderful guy. I'm yeah, sure he was. He, he just had one. That's... Well, yeah. So anyway, so you're down to what a hundred of them now? You're down to a hundred. No, I still take my vitamins, but not as many. No, How about no, you, no, really? no, I don't take that many vitamins. Either, no, but you so, take no. some. Sure, yeah. sure. The, the free radical killers and so all that I look stuff. Look at yeah. his eyes, and it's I see. Yo, Estevez, how are you doing? All right. Good. Yeah. All right. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm throwing, I'm thinking of Rio Blair and I'm getting upset here. No, we can, we can test all my vitals if you want while I'm here. You bring a thing out. You touch your vitals? No, 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 test my vitals. Oh, just, test your yeah, vitals. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> How much time in that hut? Ah, right, let's take a look at this team. Here he is as Coach Gordon Bombay. What a name that is, huh? Yeah. Inspiring like his team to work together. Here's a scene from D2, The Mighty Ducks. Oh, my goodness. Yes. Are, Are you okay, okay Princess? Princess? Don't we Let have a, a, don't we have a towel for Princess Tanko? <laughs> Princess Tanko, well, that was pretty sensational. Uh, we were wondering how long you could hold your breath up there, and then you were sitting in the back enjoying the show. Uh, yeah. How long can you hold your breath? Uh, um. um. Oh, the kimono. Shall we put the kimono yes, on? Yes, let me put that All on. Right. Yeah. This, this, incidentally, is a $15,000 kimono. Oh, maybe and, I'll keep and it. And she is the first <laughs> and only woman to be named Magician of the Year by the Academy of Magical uh, Arts and Sciences. Yeah, this is lovely. Anyway, congratulations on a wonderful, uh, on a wonderful illusion. <laughs> Quite a story here, you know. She was uh, an, an intern for uh, Japan's Master Illusion. How are you? Hey, guys, good to see you. Nice to see you again. Welcome back. Have a seat, Mark. You know, Mark, uh, I think has lost some weight since the television days, right? Oh, well, thin down a little bit. We always try, right? Yes, Do you bet? yes, yeah, yeah. Yes. Yes. Been jogging a lot? Yes. <laughs> yeah. I jogged over here this morning. Absolutely. How many times? Was he gracious? This is his forty-seventh Broadway show. Forty-seven Broadway yes. shows. Isn't that wonderful? You know, for a while there, what would we do without Neil Simon? He was the guy that kept it all going on Broadway. Yes. There was yeah. a drought there for a time. Yeah. And it was only Neil Simon that kept yeah. it all going. Yeah. And you don't dare change one word. Do you? I mean... Well, you don't want to. Uh, the thing you find out about Neil Simon's work is that if you change it, it's not going to be as funny as, as what he wrote. Yeah. Really? Is, is, is that there right? reason yeah, that absolutely. Z is there and yeah. not A? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. Now, do you get laughs in the same spot every night? This show is very consistent. <laughs> I've never been introduced as Problem, problem Plague before. Plague. That's, that's uh, charming, but that kind of sums up your guy, right? The character oh, yeah. you play? Yeah. And, what and actually his... my life. Oh, what? oh, no. But what is this guy's problem, anyways? Insecure? He's not confident? 
Uh, basically, uh, we always say if George ever got a spin-off series, he gets in his own way a lot, and people do it for him as well. In yeah. case he's having a good day, some <laughs> other people get in his way. He's never quite it's sure a, no, if it's, it's a good a, day or it's a bad right. I know if I'm reading the script wrong. and I get to page 40 and nothing's has been got, very successful. Hasn't he, though? Yeah. It's a strange sort of thing. Mm. My, my favorite parts of the show take place uh, in, in the restaurant. Mm -hmm. That uh, they say in Entertainment uh, Weekly is uh, Patrick Tom's uh, restaurant. Yeah. But you actually shoot the series in Los Angeles. Of we course do. they do. These four renegade New Yorkers who have left our town, gone out there, and still pretend they're there through television. We do. Mm. Mm. I bought a house just you in time for the second riots to happen, <laughs> yeah. so they could burn it down as I as I closed well, the. Well, that's the final straw. You understand? I that, understand. Don't you? I'm coming back to New York where there's no violence. Uh, <laughs> and I had an apartment in New York which we gave up last you Christmas. Sold that. Yeah. So you have severed your tie. Don't you know tongue. you're never supposed to give up an never, apartment in never New York? Never, never give up. I know that. I will never you? get that apartment again. <laughs> that's right. Like my father says, that building I could have bought in 19, <laughs> but twenty thousand dollars it's worth. <laughs> that's exactly right. <laughs> You severed your ties. I did. Ah. Now, how does it feel to come back, knowing that you have no place to light? You know, it's great <laughs> being a tourist. I never realized when... Oh, you... Yes, yes. Oh. Special treatment at the oh. hotel. But you played such a great sleaze in Pretty Woman. Mm -hmm. That come naturally to you, Jason? Okay, well, let's take a look. It <laughs> might work. Who knows? That's from Seinfeld. All right, here we go. All right, tell me. Uh -huh. It's like the old Beatles cover. That's right. That's exactly what they went for. Yeah, it's a wonderful cast. And incidentally, Jason is in town to... Um, guest host the uh, Saturday Night Live show this Saturday night. I guess that's when you know you've really made it, huh? That's a milestone. That's a milestone. You had the other one. You, you did Barbara Walters. That's yeah, the that other one. That is a milestone. Barbara Definitely. Walters and Saturday Night Live. And well, then what about Regis? Shoes. What does he get to do? Reg you, you gave me my start. Did I? That's right. Remember when we came here with the guys from the rink? and we... ...evening performance of Regis and Kathy Lee in concert under the stars. And there's more. Workout... <laughs> <laughs> Listen to this, Kathy Lee and I, this is from the fax machine, share a same birthday, and guess what, I'm an interior designer, her alternate career choice. We have so much in common. I'm going to bring out one dog at a time, the oldest one first, right? Because it's just like bringing a new baby into your home. You know, you've got to acquaint everybody with the, with the it's baby. It's a little bit more thrilled, but it didn't last very long. After, she was so happy to have company and somebody to sniff and somebody to play with. Sniff? Um, well, that's what dogs do, Reed. They do. They how, do. Uh, how long was Chardonnay uh, the only one in the house? Let's see, we got Six Chardonnay months. as a birthday Let me just go grab Chardonnay so yeah, we can see Chardonnay. We got her in June. And what a kisser she is. An absolute She's a great, great dog. dog. She's really a But it is a major problem. It happens more and more now. And I love her little uh, the bows. Little bows. Yeah, yeah, they are great. Although Paul people Reed really sometimes... Yes. Boy, I don't know if she's about to share you with anyone. Well, she's since then had Shabley and two babies. So And she sleeps in the in a heated garage now. So she, I think she... They have been on major, major diets. So, but, but the puppies eat diet. pretty good there. No, but, they don't. <laughs> they don't get any people. There'll be a little bit of an adversary relationship at the beginning, which is normal. Yeah. And we're going to talk about that in a little while. Right. For her sister. Uh, number two. Lee, you think Chardonnay's fat. Wait Let's get number Chablis. two. She is hey, enormous. Reach, <laughs> reach. I think Everyone she's got has a, a glandular dog. problem. She, <laughs> it's like my mother always said with my dogs, they're big bones, they're just, you know? No a, fat dogs, big bones. Yeah, a lot of people are allergic They are. You know, but let's, let's, let's go Is through some... Is that doggy doo-doo? No. <laughs> that's the stuff that's oh, in okay, their fur. Right, okay. Let's go through some really important tips in terms of getting these... Owl here, and I have a stuffed animal here. And it's not the reaction we get from these guys. This, smell, right. this, this is your Kathy, here you Thank go, you. it's all yours, okay? The other thing you Let want to remember... Let me see what he smells like. <laughs> oh, he smells so sweet. Little He's a sweet smelling puppy. The other thing you want to remember... He needs is, some jupe. ...is understand... <laughs> He needs a lot of you. So if another guy or another woman moved into your house and it just can happen, equal time is very important. And when you can't supervise them, Kathy, what I suggest doing, and you will find them sleeping whisker to whisker, I promise. Here. No, it's not pressure. It's just, it's just a matter of if you jump it too quick, you're not going to let them resolve well, your problems. Shabby's really because Shabby is very, very lazy. Shard, I was always trying to get her to, to run with her, and she yeah. won't. Well, Chablis the and Chardonnay, they're Bichon Listen, um, <laughs> listen, listen. <laughs> Are you two guys, are you two guys ready to meet, I mean, ready for Regis? Regis? All right, let's go get Regis. Be nice to him. Now, oh. when, when I introduce them, is I will put my knee between them and let him just kind of stand in Forget everything else in the world. I want wins. That's the only thing he wants. So, <laughs> this dog being Paul, you can put those two on the phone. I'll sit down here with him just to make sure there's no problems. No, I don't think so. Hey, guys. Hey, look, look they're real interested, huh? Charge. Hey, guys, you want to see a new friend? Want to play with Regis? You want to see a new friend? There you go, yeah. yeah. What? Is that your buddy? Charge. Is that your buddy? Charge. Yeah. And notice I'm so giving... so much bigger than him. I'm giving a lot of attention to the puppies.